Alrighty, guys. So I asked um, the the thing um, that you know has the name that rhymes with kombucha, kind of. Nope, just kidding. It ends with an A. Um, it starts with an A and ends with an A. Um, and if I talk to her, she'll respond. So I can't say her name out loud. Um, to roll a number between one and three, and uh, it landed on three. And so the third comment that was commented uh, was my cousin Mackenzie's comment, and that was to draw Black Widow. So uh, she also said that she wanted it to be she wanted a how-to, um, like that was her favorite kind of video. So uh, yeah, we're gonna do like a we're gonna do a um, a uh, I'm gonna draw Black Widow, and then I'm gonna um, do a how-to, like how to color it, and yeah. So it'll be like a kind of step-by-step -step kind of thing. Alrighty, you guys. Uh, so this is the uh, inked version of um, Black Widow. Uh, so what we're gonna do now is uh, like just kind of step one is to lay out all your base colors, so that way you know um, what is going to be what color at the end of the video, not at the end of the video, but at the end of the like the picture, like what is going to be what. So like what color everything's gonna be. So like uh, her hair is gonna be. So I, I'm gonna put an orange because it kind of has like a uh, you want like to put like the lightest color that you want it. You want to put that in first. Um, and if I want it to be a little bit orangey, I'm gonna put that in before the red. That way, it will still like stay there. Um, you know, so like orange and then gray uh, for everything, like for like the clothing, and then blue for like the those weird like highlights. I don't like see you know you know what I'm talking about those highlights right there, um, as well as her baton thingies. Um, so I'm just gonna throw that into super speed and get it done with. Alrighty, you guys, so now that you've colored the whole thing, um, well, not the whole thing, um, now that you've colored the whole thing, um, take, uh, pick one of the colors, I would advise not the gray f to start, pick like either, I guess, skin tone, or if you want to do red, and basically, you're going to try to blend it, and I'll show you how to do this in the, like the, the quick speedy thing, but basically the idea is that you're going to want to try to blend um, the colors so that they work, I guess. That's, that's not super specific. You'll see it. Um, basically, you want to have two or three colors. It doesn't really matter that you can be able to blend from a dark to a light tone. Um, so, so like, um, I'm going to say that the light source is coming, uh, let's go, let's go the light source is coming from here. Um, I feel like that'll just make it easier. Um, that way you guys all know where the light source is coming from. Um, and it's not like, wait, what's do what's going on? What's happening? Um, yeah. Don't do anything with the blue yet. If you guys are going a little bit ahead of me, don't do anything with the blue. Um, that will be the last part of, uh, the video. Um, just like 
finishing it up. Alrighty, you guys, so here's what I've noticed. Um, the difference between marker and uh, pencils is that uh, markers look better when they're on camera and pencils look worse when they're on camera. So it's very shiny. I don't know. Does this help? Like, I'm just gonna. Oh, my camera doesn't. No, that's definitely worse. Um, well, ah, that's not quite as bad I feel like um anyway so it doesn't look quite as good as it does in person I feel like it looks a lot better in like if you're actually looking at it um so this is actually going to my cousin Mackenzie and I'm not sure if I said that earlier in the video or not um, but it is um so for the last part um, I mentioned uh, this is uh, going to be adding the blues so the all of these like the blue parts in like that are in the drawing right now would actually be putting off a lot of blue light so what we're going to be doing not blue light like no um anyways um not like technology light but like literal light that is blue um so basically what we're going to do is we're going to add a highlight to all of these colors um and make them blue oh by the way i'm sorry if this was like kind of complicated of a tutorial this was probably the the most difficult tutorial um that i've tried to do in this channel uh, but if you guys could tell me if, if it worked out for you guys or not, that would be great in the comments. Um, it's almost it's almost done, so for those of you guys who are watching still, uh, you know, holding out, um, I'm gonna just going to lay, lay on these highlights, and yeah, see you guys um, at the end of the video. Um, for those of you who are just completely lost and have no idea what's going on right now, um, I'm sorry. You, I don't know why you stuck along this, why you stuck here this long. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, the, you didn't, you didn't need to add the last like blue. That's just kind of something that I did, and it doesn't really stand out very much on camera. It's a little bit more obvious that I did it on like in person. Again, colored pencils are so much better in person which is funny because it's the exact opposite with markers it looks so much better on camera I think it's actually probably for the same reason um, but anyway we'll we'll talk about that later um, so yeah Mackenzie um, this is for you you've been a long time fan and supporter of this channel so I'm very glad that it went to you um, so yeah um, I'll see you guys on the next video uh, I hope this made even a little bit of sense to you guys um, and I hope to see you guys on the next video uh, see ya